Hey, what's up everybody from Neville World here today to do my review of Bleach Chapter 466. And I got a couple of complaints with this chapter. I thought it was pretty decent, but there's one big complaint. I'll get to that a little bit later. Chapter starts off. Uh, Renji the finally defeated Dirty Boots. And, you know, about time. That shouldn't have lasted too long, to be honest with you, because dirty boots um you know he's walking with her and he's basically saying let's get out of this game because you know she actually lived through their little fight or whatever he's like let's get out of this game um you know she's like with the likes of you and you know they kind of have a little banter back and forth and basically she commits suicide i think she explodes or something like that because uh after there's like a big explosion we flash to yukio and he's like um you know sacrificing yourself oh how noble or something so it seems as though dirty boots committed suicide because she didn't want to be saved by the likes of renji since she couldn't defeat him and you know he's like you know i'm not gonna uh take your life or whatever so it seems as though she committed suicide kind of a crusty way to go out you know just because you couldn't be defeat renji but um we didn't see a clear thing of that so maybe she wasn't successful or something but um then we get to yukio and Toshiro buses in, and Toshiro's like, you know, I'm taking you down or whatever. And this is where my gripe comes in, that, you know, the Yu Yu Hakusho thing kind of got to stop. Um, it's getting really, really close to borderline plagiarism and, you know, taking everything. It started off cool. I didn't mind the concept. You know, okay, it's similar to Game Master with uh, the whole, you know, controlling the game but now it's getting a little bit to the point where like the character actually seems like some of the characters from the sense we chapter black stuff where he's like you know oh, everyone abandoned me i'm alone i hate my parents they never were there for me and if i'm correct that was either the game master or another one of those miscreants from that whole group from the chapter black arc and it's if this is the whole case that all these full brains were brought together because they hated society and if you look back even with dirty boots she was like you know by the likes of you um you know it seems as though that's, that whole concept as well as was taken, and I don't appreciate that. You know, me, I'm always gung-ho about everything, and I thought still a lot of the other stuff in the chapter, you know, uh, Dirty Boots going out crazy was crazy. Um, you know, the whole fight between Toshiro and Yukio was kind of cool. You know, Yukio's like, I control this whole game. You can't do nothing, and Toshiro's going around, and Toshiro ends up with the upper hand freezing him in the end, and it ends off with Yukio's, like, with a crazy face, like, oh, my gosh, I couldn't believe it, you know, because Toshiro's a beast. And, you know, can't take nothing away. But my main gripe is that one thing, and I really think that that's going to be the case, that all the full bringers were basically, like, you know, um, outcasts of society, or they have a gripe with society because of this reason and that reason. And, ugh, I really hope that, uh, you know, it switches up or something. But overall, you know, it was a pretty awesome chapter. I can't even lie. Toshiro really is such a beast. Just one gripe with it. Um, let me know if you agree with the gripe. If you disagree, you know, whatever, give me your thoughts on that. And overall, what you thought of the chapter in the comment section below or whatever your response. And thumbs up if you think Toshiro is a beast because I thought he was a beast. Just one gripe, one gripe. Kubo, switch it up a little bit. Don't keep on with the Yu Yu Hakusho feel. I understand that it seems like that's a big inspiration, but change it up a little bit. But that's all I have for you guys today. I'm Fennel World. Thanks for watching my video. Hope you enjoyed and have an awesome day.